Hi, and welcome back uh, to our third astronomy video. Um, I'm Aaron, and this is Evan. And today we're going to talk about how we measure the universe. Um, measuring the universe is one of the most important things uh, because we have to quantify um, universal constants, how far away things are. Um, and it's really important to understanding how our solar system, our galaxy, and uh, beyond that um, form and interact. The first uh, astronom uh, the first uh, unit of measure we're going to be talking about is the astronomical unit, or the AU. Um, essentially, it's a unit of measurement equal to 149.6 million, or approximately eight light minutes uh, kilometers. Uh, it's the mean distance um, from the center of the Earth to the center of the sun. So it's essentially the average distance of Earth's orbit. Um, it's used to measure relative distances within our solar system uh, or another solar system. Uh, if you're measuring if a planet's in the Bully Lux zone or something like that. Um, and it also is important in the another unit of measure as well. Uh, and now light years are another unit of astronomical uh, measurements. Um, it's equivalent to the distance that light travels in one year. Uh, almost six million, six trillion miles, uh, which is massive. Um, and to measure super long distances, generally between star systems and galaxies. So things that you can barely see with your naked eye in the night sky. And lastly, we have the parsec, which is probably the most uh, useful unit of measure. Um, and essentially, it's a unit of measurement equivalent to approximately 3.26 light years or 206,000 uh, astronomical units. Um, and really, it has the same kind of, it measures the same things that light years do in terms of distance to objects that are very far away. Um, but it's unique in that it it's uh, useful for getting accurate distances uh, from faraway stars that are difficult to measure. And what it does is it uses the Earth and the sun uh, to make a right triangle. So you see you have the angle here um, is 90 degrees and you have the leg uh, of the triangle is uh, exactly one astronomical unit. So the distance in parsecs that you're going for is this bottom leg on, uh, here, um, which uh, is the distance to some far off star. So you have this angle of uh, theta, which is an unknown angle. And if you measure it, uh, and it's equal to one arc second, which is like a very, um, which is very, very small. Um, it's uh, a fraction of a degree. Um, uh, when that angle is equal to one arc second, this distance here on the bottom, the distance from the sun to the distant star is one parsec. So really all you need is the angle between uh, created here and the astronomical unit, which we already have, to find the distance in parsec. Uh, and this distance uh, works out to 3.26 light years. So this is very helpful for measuring far off stars and galaxies and other um, bodies where it's really difficult to find an accurate measurement. Um, and it's just very useful for creating precise measurements for far away objects. Uh, that's the end of our presentation, and thank you for watching. Thank you.